Gopi Jana Bala Pa Kiri Bala Tari Gopi Jana Bala Pa Kiri Bala Tari Gopi Jana Bala Pa Kiri Bala Tari Yashodanandana prajajana ranjana Yashodanandana prajajana ranjana Yashodanandana prajajana ranjana Yashodanandana prajajana ranjana Yamuna tira vanachari Yamunatiravanachari Yamunatiravanachari Jaya Radha Madhava Kunjabihari Krishna Krishna Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Om Namo Bhagavate Vasudevaya Om Namo Bhagavate Vasudevaya Om Namo Bhagavate Vasudevaya Om Namo Bhagavate Vasudevaya Om Namo Narayanam Namasritya Naram Chaivana Rotamam Naram Chaivana Rotamam Devim Saraswatim Vyatam Devim Saraswatim Vyatam Tato Jayam Vedaya Tato Jayam Vedaya Nasta Prayeshu Vabhadreshu Nasha Prayeshu Abhadreshu Bhagavata Sevaya Bhagavati Uttama Sloke Bhagavati Uttama Sloke Bhakti Bhavati Naishtiti We're reading Srimad Bhagavatam, Canto 4, chapter number 31. Text number 24. Uh, chapter uh, Guru Maharaj, uh, chap, sorry, no. chapter 30, 31, hmm? okay. Canto 4. Take Bhagavatam, Canto 4, Canto 4, Gadra. Uh, chapter 31, the last chapter. Last chapter. Uh, Trente et un. Trente et un. Text number twenty-four. Ah, one, quatre. Trente-four. Ah, one, quatre. One, quatre. One, quatre. Or is it? Vingt-quatre. 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 Vingt-qu
translate. I will translate. Yes. 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 But I speak and the book translate. Yes, it will automatically yes. translate. Yes. Oh. Okay, so we'll read the Sanskrit. Te pitan mukam rityatam. Te pitan mukam rityatam. Te pitan mukam niryatam. Te pitan mukam niryatam. Yasho loka malapa. Yasho loka malapa. Yasho loko loka malapa. Yasho loka malapa. Hare nish amya tatpadam. Hare nish amya tatpadam. Hare nish amya tatpadam. Hare nish amya tatpadam. Jayantas tat gatim ya ya. 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 Te pitan muka niryatam. Te pitan muka niryatam. Yasholo kamalapaham. Yasholo kamalapaham. Hare nish amya tadpadam. Hare nish amya tadpadam. Jayantas tadgatim yayu. Jayantas tadgatim yayu. Te pitan muka. Te pitan mukaniryatam. Te pitan mukaniryatam. Yasholo kamalapaham. Yasholo kamalapaham. Hare nish amya tadpadam. Hare nish amya tadpadam. Diyantas tadgatim yayu. Diyantas tadgatim yayu. Te pitan mukta nidhyatam. Te pitan mukta nidhyatam. Yesho loka malapaham. Yesho loka malapaham. Hare nishyam yatat padam. Hare nishyam yatat padam. Dhyayantas tad gatim yayu. Dhyayantas tad gatim yayu. Te pitan mukta nidhyatam. Te pitan muka niryatam Yasho loka malapaham Yasho loka malapaham Ahir ni cham ya tat parim Ahir ni cham ya tat padam Dhyayan tas tat gatim ya hu Dhyayan tas tat gatim ya yu Te pitan muka niryatam Te pitan muka niryatam Yasho loka malapaham Yasho loka malapaham Harir nimash yatat padam Ayer nisham yatat padam Jayan tatat hatim yayu Jayan tas tat gatim yayu Te the prachetas. The prachetas. Api. Api. Also. Also. Tat. Tat. Of Nara. Of Nara. Muka. Muka. From the mouth. From the mouth. Niryatam. Niryatam. Gone forth. Gone forth. Yasha. Yasha. Glorification. Glorification. Loka. Loka. Of the of the world. Of the world. Mala. Mala. Sin. Sin. Apaham. Apaham. Destroying. Destroying. Hare. Hare. Of Lord Hare. Of Lord Hare. Nishamya. 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 Having heard. Having heard. Tat. Tat. Of the Lord. Of the Lord. Padam, feet, feet, feet. Dhyanta, dhyanta, 
meditating upon meditating upon tatgatim tatgatim unto his abode unto his abode yayu yayu went went translation hearing from narada's mouth the glories of the lord which vanquish all the ill fortune of the world the prachetas also became attached to the supreme personality of godhead meditating on his lotus feet they advance to the ultimate destination Huh? We have to repeat this. Okay. Do you want to repeat it? Not necessary. Okay. Purport. Purport by Shri Prabhupada. Here it is seen that by hearing the glories of the Lord from a realized devotee, the prachetas easily attained strong attachment for the Supreme Personality of Godhead. Then meditating on the lotus feet of the Supreme Lord at the end of their lives, they advanced to the ultimate goal, Vishnu Loka. It is sure and certain that anyone who always hears the glories of the Lord and thinks of his lotus feet will reach that supreme destination. As Krishna says in the Bhagavad Gita, Manmana Bhava Madhbhakto Madhya Jimam Namaskuru Mamme Vaishyasi Satyam Te Pratijani Priyasi Me Always think of me and become my devotee. Worship me and offer your homage unto me. Thus you will come to me without fail. I promise you this because you are my very real friend, my very dear friend. Om Magyana Jai Shri Krishna Chaitanya Prabhu Nityananda Shri Advaita Gadana Shri Vasati Gaur Bhakta Vrinda Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare Hare So the prachetas were very fortunate that they got the association of Narada Muni. Of course they were very fortunate before because they got Lord Shiva's association and then they also got to meet with the Lord, the Supreme Lord Vishnu and then before the end, just before the end of their life they met with Narada Muni and Narada Muni could instruct them about the goal of life, about how to become attached to the Supreme Lord. So the Prachetas followed the instructions of Narada Muni and they fixed, they put, they fixed their mind on the lotus feet of the Lord. And by remembering the lotus feet of the Lord and by remembering Him and, and all of his, the Lord's teachings, then the prachetas were able to easily go back home, back to Godhead. So Srila Prabhupada quotes the verse from the Bhagavad Gita, how 
uh, well, the verse which comes at the end of the ninth chapter, uh, actually that verse comes twice, right? It comes at the end of the ninth chapter and then it comes again in the eighteenth chapter, towards the end of the eighteenth chapter. Lord Krishna is saying four things, we have to do four things. Uh, engage our mind first of all in thinking of Him. Very important to fix the mind on the Lord. The mind can be the friend and the mind can be the enemy. So we have to control the mind. We have to force the mind to think of the Lord and the mind will rebel, the mind will resist, does not want to surrender. We have to force it, we have to bring it to the lotus feet of the Lord. The lotus feet of the Lord is where we begin our meditation and our service to the Lord. First from the lotus feet, then only we can work up the different limbs of the body of the Lord the thighs and the hips and the chest and the throat and the neck and then the lotus face. These are all the different bodily limbs of the Lord. So we do not immediately look on the face of the Lord but we look at His lotus feet. We begin from His lotus feet and by remembering the lotus feet of the Lord, then we can purify ourselves and we can remember, He is my master and I am trying to become a servant. So we want to try to become a servant of the Lord. It is not an easy thing. We're trying, it takes practice. We are all rebellious. We want to be the master, we don't want to be the servant. But we have to surrender and it's important for us to train our mind to surrender at the lotus feet of the Lord. So that is the beginning of devotional service, bringing the mind to the lotus feet. Just like Maharaj Ambarish, he was a great devotee. He engaged in all the different activities of devotional service. He engaged in chanting the holy name and he, he engaged in temple worship, he engaged in distributing prasadam, he engaged in serving the Vaishnavas. But the very first thing he did was to fix his mind at the lotus feet of the Lord. We say, Savai mana Krishna padara vindayor vachamsi vaikunta gunanavarnani kalo hare mandira marjanadishu shrutim chakra chutta sakatodaye. Maharaj Ambarish used all of his different limbs and senses for the service of Krishna. But the first thing was the mind to bring the mind. By the mind one can be elevated and by the mind one can be degraded. So it's very important that we control our mind and we should bring it to take shelter at the lotus feet of the Lord. So for that's the first thing, use our mind to take shelter at the lotus feet of the Lord and to think to think of the Lord, to think of ourselves as a servant, trying to be a servant of Him. So engage your mind in thinking of me, then become my devotee, become a devotee of the Lord. Everyone can become a devotee. We have to get association with devotees to become a devotee. Without association then it's very difficult to be a devotee. But when we get association with devotees, then our devotion can increase a lot. So association is very important. We need to associate with devotees. Engage your mind in thinking of me, become my devotee. Worship me. 
So that's what we were doing. We were offering our tea here to the deity and we were offering puja and like that. We off when we cook, we offer our food. This is all part of worshipping Krishna. Worshipping Krishna. Uh, temples are there. Other temples, of course, you can, other religions, they also have, they have their place of worship. They have the mosque and they have the, the church and people will go there and worship God. So we worship God here in our own simple way. We have a small temple, we have the deity, we have pictures of Guru and like that. And we can make offerings, we can offer ourselves to Lord Krishna. So engage your mind in thinking of me, become my devotee, offer obeisances. Bowing down before the Lord is very important for us. Sometimes we see people, I was, go to, I was in China, Guangzhou, there's a Buddhist temple there and people go to the temple, all the way to the temple, they offer obeisances, the whole way. They will offer obeisances, get up and bow down and this way they'll walk to the, go to the temple offering obeisances. And Sanatan Goswami, he would go around the Govardhan hill offering obeisances. Some great devotees, they will do like that, they will offer obeisances around the Govardhan hill. They say, Dandabhat Parikrama. And, it, and the Buddhists here also bowing down. Sometimes people say, oh, I don't like to bow down, why I should bow down? And Prabhupada said, you may not like to bow down to Krishna, but you have to bow down to old age. You have to bow down to disease and you have to bow down to death. So it's better to bow down to Krishna rather than to be forced to bow down to old age and disease and death. So bowing down before Krishna is one of the angas, one of the limbs of devotional service. And we bow down, we offer our obeisances also to devotees. We, we practice humility. Bowing down is help us to develop humility because we're, we're in the material world and we have false ego. We are proud. We don't like to bow down, but we have to bow down. And we have to practice becoming humble by bowing down. So offer obeisances to me. Uh, Krishna said, engage your mind in thinking of me, become my devotee, offer obeisances to me and worship me, right? Four different become, items we have to do. Become my devotee. Become my devotee. Worship me. me. Offer a business and engage your mind in thinking. Yeah, thinking. Right. So becoming a devotee. Becoming a devotee is not not a, it's not just a dress which makes somebody a devotee. It's not just because I wear a dhoti I'm a devotee or because I put the tea like on my face that I'm a devotee. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the devotee means one who has devotion, one who has love for Krishna, who has devotion for Krishna. And one who has devotion for Krishna, then they will want to do service for Krishna. They will want to serve, to give service. In the material world, everyone wants to be the master. They don't like to serve, they want to be served. But we, our position is to give service. We say there's more pleasure in giving than in receiving, right? When you give something, you feel more pleasure than when you get something. <laughs> yeah. It's better to give than to receive. So this, this is the principle of devotional service. 
We want to give everything to Krishna, to give our body, our mind and our words all in the service of Krishna. This will be very good for us. When we use our body, like I said, offering obeisances as when we give you body, you see Kulan is cooking, cooking is also giving your body for the service of Krishna. So we use our mind to think of Krishna, to think of Krishna, think of Krishna's pastimes, think of Krishna's teachings, think of the different slokas in the Bhagavad Gita. So we can sing the songs about Krishna, we can recite the slokas about Krishna, help that will help us to think about Krishna. We're always thinking, but often we're thinking about eating, we think about sleeping, we think about these things. We have to think about Krishna, Krishna's service. So change, change the attitude, change the, the, the thinking. To, instead of thinking about putting food in the belly, think about giving to Krishna, offering to Krishna. And that will be good for us. If you give to Krishna, then Krishna will give to you. Krishna takes care. Krishna, of course, Krishna doesn't need our offerings. He has many Lakshmi serving him. The goddess of fortune in the spiritual world, they're offering many flowers and fruits to Krishna. So we don't have much to offer to Krishna. But Krishna wants our love, He wants our devotion. We want to give that to Krishna. That will help us and it's very pleasing to Krishna. So Krishna says in the Bhagavad Gita, for one who is teaching, one who is teaching about me, to, then they're very dear to me. So we also try to teach about Krishna to others. And in that way we please Lord Krishna and we become dear to Krishna. So we have these things to think about. Uh, the Prachetas, they followed the instructions of Narada Muni and because he followed, they went back to Godhead easily, went back to Godhead. So Prabhupada said, it's not difficult. You follow four principles, you chant every day Hare Krishna mantra minimum 16 rounds and use the rest of the time to worship Krishna, then at the end of life you can go back home, back to God and be with Krishna. So we're practicing serving Krishna here and one day we'll go there and we'll serve Krishna there. So Krishna is waiting for us to come back, to be with them. All right, any question? Srila Prabhupada, the instructions are uh, the same as Nārada Muni's instructions, right, Guru Maharaj? Yes, yeah. yes. Hmm. Yes, Narada is in our line of disciplic succession. So, Narada Muni's instructions are there in Srimad Bhagavatam and Prabhupada is presenting the Srimad Bhagavatam for us. He's telling us what did Narada teach. He's telling us how Narada went to different places and how he spread Krishna consciousness. He's telling us about the activities of Narada Muni. He's translating for us. Do you have any question? What's the name? Uh, Valentina. Valentina. Oh, oh, this is Valentina. Yeah, she's like, she's like, she's How to read?
Okay. How to read all 16 rounds at once? Well, uh, how to do it? You have to be very determined. You have to get up early in the morning. Wake up early in the morning, don't talk to anyone and just chant. <laughs> yeah, sometimes difficult. We have to go to sleep early, otherwise it's Yeah, to get up early, you have to sleep early, right? You want to get up early, you have to sleep early. But you have to also be careful not to get into gossip, talking, mm. a lot of idle talk. We mm. say this is, uh, the, the, there, there is Gramya Kata, and there is Krishna Kata and Gramya Kata. Krishna Kata is to talk about Krishna and Gramya, te, Gramya Kata is a village talk. In the village, you know, the ladies, when they get together, they will talk to each other. Oh, we are also talking like that. <laughs> yeah, so that's Village means not they will talk, Guru Maharaj, how is your family? Yeah, how is your family? How, oh, my child is not well. Oh, my husband's angry. Oh, but I you. Oh, this, oh, that. Oh, no money. Oh, oh pro so many problems. Oh, my mother, oh, my father, oh. Yeah, yeah, a lot of problems. Yeah. Is it possible to read the us and listen the helmet from the back and this Bhagavad Srimad Bhagavatam? Is it possible to read the the kind of, uh, Japa? Eh, ah, ah eh, okay. Uh, is it possible to read the Japa and also uh, Srimad Balizan Srimad Bhagavatam? No. <laughs> How can you do it? You can't do two things at one time. Because Java, you do, you have to listen to Java. Yes. And, uh, yes, Srimad Bhagavatam. You cannot do. <laughs> <laughs> At 6.30 she listens to the Srimad Bhagavatam in, uh, from uh, the YouTube. No, Srimad Zoom, 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 Zoom. Uh, New Mayapur? No, no, she, uh, no, 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 from her place in Ukraine in Zoom. Oh, from Ukraine. Uh, she doesn't have a time after that for Java. She doesn't have any time for Java. Because she has in the morning she used to listen to Srimad Bhagavatam. Mm -hmm. After that it she becomes difficult for Java. And then she has to go to work. Yeah. Uh, she you have to go to uh, travail, to work, après. No, she has to go to the school, after that she has to go to the French school. And after that she has to go to the school, after that she has to go to the French school. cooking, cleaning, like this it becomes difficult. So you have to get up earlier. Ah, two, 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 like sometimes it happens like that. Bless for the early, she asks for a blessing to rise for us. All of us, Guru Maharaj, bless us. Bless us. Guru Maharaj wakes up so early, very early, sometimes at 2 o'clock, 1 o'clock. But I know for him, it's for us, not for him. For us, we can be at 4 or 5 o'clock. 
determination uh, because she always have determined she will think I have to do this after that it's not possible she broke down oh. some yes she had yeah I think she's um, you are asking how to do consistently right mm -hmm. uh, consistent. determination huh? determination yes determination okay well it comes determination comes by controlling the senses Determination comes by control, you can transmit in French. Yeah. 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 She understands. Mm -hmm. yeah. We have to be very strict in controlling the senses. Mm. Very strict in controlling the senses. For example, Guru Maharaj. Well, like waking up in the morning, sleeping, um, what you eat. When you eat, when you eat, what you eat. Yeah. For us, sometimes what happens? Sometimes in the evening we get tempted and eat a lot. That's yeah. all. The next day is gone. Waking yeah. up. Yeah. Right. It's difficult to manage. Eat at night. Yeah. Then difficult to get up. Then I think the 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 most difficult is you know when we are staying in the world. It's very it's much more difficult than in an ashram. Because in the Nashwan we have some schedule, you know, it's very strict and it's very, and we are also surrounded with all the devotees or with Brahmachari like that. Mm -hmm. So it's very easy. But when we are outside in the world, that is very difficult. It's more difficult. Yeah, so you have to do the good sadhana in the morning yes. before you yes. go out to work. Yes, yes. The early morning, yes. the sadhana. Yes, sadhana. Yes. Early morning. Early. Yeah, yes. yes. Early morning, Sarana. Yes. Where I come from, the patient? Patient? Yes. Where does patience come from? Mm. Well, <laughs> patience comes from. Uh, how I can get the patient? <laughs> how you can get patient? I think, uh, yeah, she's asking because she called her uh, daughter yesterday. She scolded her daughter yesterday. Really? And the daughter cried for the whole night and today she has to join the school for the first day. Oh, yeah. oh. Today is the first day of school. School, yes. And she cried the whole night? Yeah, because she scolded at the daughter. Oh. And be patient. How to be patient? I have to think about but that's also determination to be patient. You need some determination and tolerance also. Patience. Uh, what do the Shastras say about patience? It, I think it's in the seventh canto. I'll look it up. Mm. Guru Maharaj, I think you said uh, somewhere while in the nectar of devotional instruction, lack of uh, uh, determination results in lack of patience. No? Oh, of course, it's mentioned in the nectar of instruction, right? Yeah, you have told me. Uthahanas, chayadayat, enthusiasm, ah, patience, yes, yes. and determination. Mm. Patience. Prabhupada doesn't talk much about how to get patience. But he, he gives an example, he said, just like the woman gets married, she immediately wants a child, but how is it possible she has to wait some, you know, it's going to take some time before she gets a child. 
So he said, like that devotee, immediately, immediately we want to be a pure devotee. Mm -hmm. It's going to be, you have to be patient. It's going to take time mm -hmm. to purify, to get rid of the material desires and to become tolerant. It doesn't happen immediately. It's not like immediately, okay, I'm chanting Hare Krishna today, now I'm a pure devotee. No, it takes time. We have to be patient. I want to see Krishna. Oh, you want to see Krishna, do you? Well, you have to be patient, you know. Krishna doesn't just give himself so easily. It takes time. So patience is required. In every endeavor, in every endeavor, Prabhupada said, you need enthusiasm, patience, and determination. So patience is required. Yeah, dealing with other people, you have to be patient. Prabhupada had to be patient. He wanted to spread Krishna consciousness. But people did not take much interest in the beginning. You had to be very patient. It took time to get people interested in Krishna consciousness. And it took time to train them. You know, it's not like immediately they become pure devotees. You have to be patient. So like that, dealing with your doctor, you have to be patient. She's come to a foreign country, very difficult for her. Yeah. You have to be tolerant and patient. Mm. Mm. Can't expect too much from her. Mm. So we have to control also our emotions. Mm -hmm. You have to control your anger. Don't get angry. But then sometimes you have to be a little angry, but at the same time try to be patient. It's not easy. Not easy sometimes. We're, we're stressed. Sometimes there's a lot of stress, a lot of pressure on us. We have to be tolerant. Okay. Tomorrow, Hare Krishna. Nice to see you. Oh, she's from Ukraine, huh? Yes. Now we are able to talk a little bit. Okay, yes. You can talk with her a little bit. Yeah, now because she's French. If she cannot speak English, I cannot speak Russian. Yeah, you have to learn French. French, yes. Now better. Donation for me? Oh, thank you very much. Very kind. Very kind. Very kind. She has four children. Yeah, she has four. Four, right? Enfants, enfants? Three, three. Her son came one time. He can play Mridanga. Oh, really? Yeah, very nice children. I saw only his son. Very nice devotee, Guru Maharaj. She is very nice. Son can play the danga. Ah, yeah. Play a little bit, yes. She could play it. When Damodar came, she played a little bit. Huh? She, yes, she can play. She? Uh, he, he, sorry. He. Mm. He can play. Son. And the next two I have never they seen. They used to go in the temple in Ukraine. Mm. No, no. Tu es allé au temple en Ukraine? Tu allais au temple en Ukraine, hein? Oui, 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 à Zaporizhia. Zaporizhia, oui, Dnieper. Zaporizhia et Baptiste Sanhama, grand festival. Oui, 
There is a big festival. Ah. Big, big festival. Second ah. <laughs> Russian. It is like in Russia. The big, big festival. Sadusanga. 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 It's, the, it's not really the Sadhusanga, she said, but it's... It's the festival. Yes, festival. It's, it's many really several days. Yes, several days. Uh, 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 no. Uh, 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 only eating the prasad. Uh, 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 Montana, is he Geneva? Oui, 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 à Geneva. They are living here. He's also living here in Geneva. His husband. And all the children also. Hare Krishna. She has made the garland. She made the garland. Uh, this one she made. Oh. This is for tomorrow. Oh, so many garlands. Yes, the magic is kindly accepted. Uh, she will come on Saturday. She will come on Saturday. Uh, 